I fell in love with the game because while most kids had cartoons, I had a Betamax tape of the 1987 NBA Finals. I'm still that 10-year-old super fan at heart. I grew up as a bench player in basketball. So I understood when I started working in media what it was like to be an underdog. I understood what it was like to earn every single thing. The joy is something that you can't lose. Kevin Durant and how he looks at a basketball. It's pure joy. One of the all-time greats. The game still makes him happy like when he was a little boy. My early days, it was just this tenacity. Availability is the best ability. You asked me to be there, I was there. You didn't ask me to be there, I was there. My one true special skill is just a curiosity of a fan. That's what's led me to have some success in speaking with some of the game's biggest names. I was the kid who was always there, I was the kid who wouldn't go home. To be successful in this field, you have to be hard headed You have to be able to run towards a wall, hit it, backpedal, run towards it again. That's what I'm proof of concept of. If you love this game so much, or if you're willing to dedicate effort and time to it, we'll eventually love you back and you'll find a place in it. Those of us who are good at this are good at it because it makes us happy. And we allow it to make us happy the same way that it made us happy when we first watched basketball when we were children. But whoever it is that's next, I hope that I can be a direct contributor to making that person 10, 20, 100 times better than I ever was. Do you love this game? Then the game has love to give back to you. I think it should be that simple. I think there should be no other qualifiers than that. Some of my best friends love the game infinitely more than I do, but their opportunities are far more limited compared to myself. I think that that's my goal, is for us to be able to recognize there's this great thing that we all love, and this thing wants to give back to all of us. I don't think that that's a complex dream, my hope is that in the future, my son can walk up to any basketball court and play basketball with other people who loves it just as much as he does. I hope in my lifetime that that's something that I'm able to see happen, if not for the people around me, then at least my son and his generation.